welcome to my channel my name is jane and this is styles by jane if you're new here thanks for stopping by if you're a repeat subscriber thanks for sticking with me on this channel we we'll talk about fashion beauty and lifestyle i talk about ways of incorporating styles into your wardrobe getting value out of your wardrobe getting value out of the pieces in your wardrobe and incorporating trends into your wardrobe my channel is big book friendly and yeah i bring out two videos every week tuesdays and saturdays I do a lot of hauls and reviews so if you're interested in content like that please stay on today's video is another zara haul i did a huge zara haul for uh november december for december and this is my december haul and i want to show you guys a couple of uh festive things i have grabbed from zara so if you're interested in that stay on items i got are from the special price collection so i have learned from shopping from zara over the years to always keep an eye out for that collection because yes <laughs> yeah a lot of good things usually go in there so i've learned to always do that so uh lately zara has been dropping a lot into the special price collection a special price collection for those who don't know is zara sales section so things are usually from 65 percent off down and they have really really good pieces on there so always check out that um check out that uh what's it called now that part of zara's website sorry Anyway, so a lot of the items I got uh, are from the special price collection. So this is more like a Zara sale haul. So yeah, let's get into that. Okay, uh, also, uh, this video also featured mango. So this is a Zara and mango haul. I got only one item from mango, so I'm going to show you. So I've been on the hunt for a good hunt suit, uh, a good plaid blazer. I haven't found one. Um, I saw this uh, mango was doing sale like two weeks ago at 35% up and I grabbed this one uh, it was described as a structured blazer so I thought this was the one I don't know how I feel about it though I like the plaid details on it I like the plaid details on it what I don't like is um how it fits me and you can see that on the side I don't like the fit on me I like how it is uh I, I thought it when they said it was structured, I was expecting more structure. You're going to see what I mean when I show you my other blazer. So this isn't structured. This is just, yeah. So I don't think I'm going to be keeping this one. I do love the color. You see how I have paired it. I paired it on with this. Um, I got this burgundy leather, four leather uh, pants from H&M. And that's what I paired it on. With, and I really, really love this look. I also paired it with my boots from Zara as well. Really, really love the look. I just wish... Uh, the blazer was fitting me a little bit differently uh, it's a bit too loose not what i wanted to go for i needed a little bit of structure and fit and this blazer wasn't hitting the mark but if you're in a hunt for a similar blazer with um pot uh, with a double breasted blazer so the details on the blazer it's double breasted uh this is uh i think this is a four pocket this is a four no it's a real pocket sorry it's a real pocket double breasted very simple lapel yeah it, if I had a couple of other blazers and I just wanted something, I would get this. But this is not what I was looking for, so this might go back. But this is it. I got this in a size large. Uh, usually for mango, my blazers are large. I got this in a size large and uh, I can't remember how much I got this right now. I'm going to either leave the price on the screen or on the description below. Okay, this next blazer. Now, when they say structured blazer... This is what I was hoping to get. This blazer is the bomb. This blazer, I got it on the special price section of the Zara's website. It was $49 or $45. Original price of this blazer was about $99. So it was $100 and it was 50% off. But this blazer is so good, so beautiful. It's giving me Chanel vibe. I'm going to come closer. So it has this... Um, leather details and it's kind of it has this sh it's shimmery and it has this um i don't know if you can write speaking it up uh, silver like silver tread on it it's very christmasy you're looking for a christmas blazer or a christmas outfit blazer this is it i love it i love how it looks i love the structure um i got this in a large which i i knew it was a gamble for me because for zara blazers my i'm usually an extra large but i got this in a large and it's really tight on me i don't know if i'm gonna keep it but i really really love how this looks like 
this is what I was expecting for a structure blazer. This blazer looks way more expensive than it is. Uh, it's double breasted. The buttons, like, look at the button detail on this. They're actually covered in leather. Like, little details like that. Um, this is a... This is a full pocket. This is my real pocket, but never mind. I don't care. It's really, really fitted. It's slimming. This blazer just hits in all the right places. I love it. Um, yeah, I pair this on where it has shoulder pad details, of course. I pair this on with this leather skirt. I also got for Zara. Is this high waisted leather skirt? It looks really, really small, but it is my size. <laughs> As you can see, it's high waisted. I love how it's stretchy, so that's how it can fit. It's high waisted, it's slimming on the waist. Um, it's this mini leather, four leather skirt. Really, really cute. I paired it on with that blazer and my white um, body from uh, Zara. This is a chic Christmas uh, dinner look. So if I was, if if we had a work party this year or one of those work dinners I usually go for during Christmas, this would be an outfit. I love how sleek and sexy it looks, and at the same time, it also looks confident. I love, I love the vibe this outfit is pulling up. Anyway, so this skirt, a uh, segue. This skirt I got in a large. It's four letter. It was forty dollars. And I love how Zara four letter actually are. I love the inner lining. I, that the fact that they're sweet this skirt feels very very good i love how it fits i love how it looks and uh, this is a keeper if you're looking for a simple mini leather skirt this is it they actually have one in, they actually have the real leather version of it and um it's about 200 dollars and i don't want to spend 200 dollars on this skirt so this is a good deal the next item i got is another blazer i did get a lot of blazers <laughs> oh god um this is another blazer this is a leather blazer this one was also from the special price collection. Um, this one was going for $39. You can see. Um, I like this and I don't like it. So, uh, details on the blazer. So, it has, these are all four pockets. But it has this, you know, I'll take this out quickly. And so it's it's an oversized blazer, and that's how it was advertised. It's an oversized blazer. And um structure lapels four pocket on the four breast pocket on one side and a flap pocket it's very big. i won't say it's very big it's oversized i think i got this in a large and it fits i think i probably should have gotten a medium but it's okay um my only concern with this blazer as i was expecting it's very uh, hard so it's not it's not the typical soft four leather material from zara this is like if you're trying to imitate um uh ship leather that's how hard this is so it fits because of the kind of vibe this is going for this reminds me very much of like fashion week or street wear if you're going for that kind of vibe um but i don't know i don't know if this is what i was looking for i don't know if this has a place in my wardrobe just yet but it's it's an oversized leather blazer I paired it on with the leather skirt I wore previously and this leather skirt as well. This is also another leather skirt I got from Zara. This one is textured. It's more like croc skin, croc leather. Uh, it's also four leather as well. This one is a bit tighter than the other one. It has less stretch than the other one, but very similar style, high waisted and everything. Uh, this did not sit well with me, so this might have to go back. This I got in a large, and this one was also, this was $49. So this one is actually more expensive than the other one. So yes, this is going back. And, but anyway, so you see both looks. What do you think about this place? Should I keep it? I don't know. I don't, I don't know how I'm going to wear it. Even though I wanted a leather blazer, I don't know how I'm going to wear this. Well, the price is good. It's $40 for this whole thing. So I'm not mad at the price. I just, I don't know if it has a place in my wardrobe just yet. But see how I have paired it. I paired it on with this in the white and my boots. Just a simple look. I think I probably should have tried it with like a, a, a jean to give me that. I don't know. I would think about this. I'll think about styling this in different ways. But yeah, on to the next one. And I had plans for this blazer. Uh, this is a this is a blue blazer. 
uh, single breasted advertisers oversized structured on the neck lapel details button details um and real pockets these are real pockets i have planned for this blazer when i saw it and i've been look, i've been on a hunt for a good striped blazer this is a darker blue than i wanted which is okay and you're gonna see the different ways i have styled this i started this with a jean trouser i started on with a skirt and i started on with a shirt I think the shirt was my favorite. I like the stripe on stripe details. The shirt was my favorite, of course. The next was with the jean. I love that oversized look that it gave me. That's my favorite way to wear jeans and blazing. That's it. But the shirt was just the bomb. I paired it on with this bag I got. And we're gonna talk about the bag in a bit. But yeah, what do you think about this blazer? Uh, this one I got in a size large and this one original price was $139. I got it for $50. So yeah, let me know. Thoughts on this blazer. Uh, is this a keeper? Should I keep this? I'm not exactly sure. I love it. I love the price for a decent blazer for $50. I wouldn't even complain. But I don't know. Uh, I'm struggling. I always struggle with styling single breasted blazer. My favorite kind of blazer is a double breasted blazer. Single breasted blazer, you're always a challenge for me. But yeah, let me know what you think. next is this gorgeousness so this is a i'm not going to call this a crop blazer but it actually seems like that i have actually if you've not seen uh i have this in a white uh i'm going to put the video up here for you to see how i styled the white one of it i grabbed the black because i this blazers they fit really really good and i have i have just been on the hunt for them ever since i tried the white I would I love to get any other colors Zara has. Zara currently has a purple and a green right now. Don't know if I subscribe to that ministry, but the black was surely for me to get. Um the black went on sale too. Original price was hundred dollars. I think it was like for forty or thirty-nine dollars. So I grabbed this as well. So details on this, it's a crop blazer. It's not really crop. It's just at the waist on like my typical oversized blazer. And you're going to see how I style it. It has this um, gold button details. I have paired it with, ooh, I paired it on with these pants um, that I got. Uh, you remember my previous uh, haul and review that I got those pants. I paired it on with these pants. However, the, the one I got in that in that video was a bit too big. So I got a smaller one. I think this fit better. So I paired two of them together and I styled it with my knee high boots. Like it's the bomb. Look at this. This is just, this is gorgeousness overload. It's killing me. Um, uh, I really, really love how this looks. My only thing that, oh, that was, I, I struggled with. Now this is a very classic look. Like in the winter, you could wear it with long knee high boots and throw on a coat. And in the summer, just pair it with heels and sandals. And it's, it's versatile. You can wear it either way. The only thing I struggled with was when I wore the two of them together, I really wanted the button details on this to show as well as on this to show. But I also did not want to wear anything inside for me to actually open it to show both. It was a struggle. It was, it was a silly problem. So I, I wanted to tuck in the, 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 the blazer, but that didn't look exactly so good. But either way, um... I think I can make it work. I just have to figure out how to do it. But I can make it work. But I love the two of them together. I really love short suits. And I think I'm I'm actually leaning onto it. I love this pant. This is a good structured pant if you're looking for. Uh, Zara has a couple of colors of this. This pant, they're so gorgeous, so classy. I don't think they would ever go out of style. This is a classic pants to wear. I love this two piece together. This was $49. This was full price. And this was on sale. So I got a complete suit for a hundred dollars or less and I am not mad at it This is actually a really really good piece. So you guys tell me How what do you think about this and the knee-high boots? Um, I love that I could wear this across seasons uh, Summer fall and uh, winter I could wear it anytime I just have to wear the appropriate shoes and if it's really cold I could have thrown on a pair of tights just to cover the other part of my legs that would show and have the knee high boot So I really really love this look. It's it's a it's a nice clean look I love this blazer. I love the length of the blazer because it's something it, 
if I wear it on some dresses, it, it wouldn't overwhelm the dress. So I love how it just sits at the waist and I could wear it with a lot of things that would just make it look clean and chic. So this is a good one for me. Have you made it halfway through this video? Do you, are you enjoying the content? If you have, please consider subscribing, liking the, liking, click the like button below and our comments, uh, uh, drop a comment telling me which of these videos or which of these items you like and how you would style it this is my chanel number two vibe you know the black one was chanel this is chanel now i really wanted the purple in this but it was sold out so i got it in this green and it was more like eh, let me see how it would look but i am not mad at it at all like this is gorgeousness overload this was on sale too original price of this was hundred dollars i got this for i think 39 or 40 dollars like i have been on a hunt for a good tweed blazer for a very long time but i didn't want to pay full price and because of that i lost out to the ones that they sold last year because for some reason during before the sale zara just took down all your tweed blazers away from your website so they were not part of the sale uh last winter sale so i've been on a hunt for a good one anyway so i saw this one and this this comes in this color and um lilac as well the lilac is really really gorgeous anyway so uh look at the button on this thing look at the button details like it's like versace on st like look at this it's gorgeous like that's the button has those button details on there has same similar button details on here as well and so how i have had this you guys tell me which you prefer because again i am mrs monochrome i paired this two ways i paired it on with this scott i got from zara and i also paired it with another pants and i'm going to talk about the pants in a minute that I also got from zara so tell me which do you prefer do you prefer with the trouser or do you prefer with the shorts uh with the trouser i paired it on with my yellow muse and i know that's not practical again because this is winter a good way i could have paired that with again with my knee high boots or the brownie high boots but i had yellow muse close by and i just wanted to see what that would look like so this again is a good summer and spring piece even though we're not shopping for that right now so this with this cut the good summer and spring piece i'm going to talk about what it looks like in winter right now which is with, with the other pan but i really really love this now when i say structured blazer this is what i think about wait see how this fits this is what i think about when i say structured blazer not that mess that we had before i'm sorry no shade to mango but this is what a structured blazer should look like so saying that um this feels this is really really good like i i can't even say a enough about this blazer it's really really good if you can grab it please do it's really really good it's it's good for work it's good for outing it's good for it, it looks expensive way more expensive than 30 dollars like <laughs> anyway so i paired it on with these pants these pants are very popular and the Zara has several colors. They just went into sale right now and they're going for like 20, 20 something dollars. So I grabbed this color and I grabbed this green and I grabbed the red. And you can see me trying them both on with this blazer as well. Uh, I really love how this looks. I love, again, the monochrome detail on it. Um, the, the pants are really, really great. They are high-waisted. They have like same details on the waist. And so that part of it really cinches you in and it's very structured. You're good work trousers, you're good outing trousers. You can wear them. Um, they're really, really classy. This would go again with in during in the summer with heels and this is a very, very nice, rich color. I wanted to red as well because I really don't have anything red in my in my wardrobe red pants. And so for $20, I was willing to do that. But these flaked on me. The zipper got spot, so this has to go back. Um, but yeah, I paired it on with this and it looks very Christmassy. Green and red are typical Christmas colors. But these pants are classic. Um, they're a lot, Zara always comes out with them, at least they have for the last three seasons. So check them out and they always come out with different colors. So I really, really love these colors. And it's unfortunate I have to send back the red book. Fits well, fit is good, sizing is good, um, looks good as well. If you're contemplating easy tron and wear, uh, this will go well with cardigans, this will go well with jackets, they will go well with blazers. Uh, they, they, they're just all around really, really good. Thing I got, again, uh, we're done with blazers, is this dress. This dress was a wimp buy for me because I was like, eh, I don't 
don't really know. I, the only thing that got me was the bottom for it. So, I don't really know. Let me just try it. And I tried it on. I'm like, oh my god, this looks really, really good. Um, uh, details on it. It's uh like um, it's crossed. What's what's this called? Like a wrap style but it's not actually full wrap it's full wrap but it's good enough to cover your boobs so if you're big boo or like uh heavy, heavy if you're large busted this is a good dupe for you because it covers why it still leaves your cleavage if you haven't seen my how to style big boobs video go see that this is the kind of outfit we need because this outfit does everything for you and i'm going to go into that it actually the waist so after the boobs is done it cinches you in the waist it has this frill detail again at the bottom. If you haven't seen how to hide your stomach video, go see that one. Because like I said, this dress does everything for you. It minimizes your boobs, hides your stomach, gives you hip, makes you look sexy. It's all around good dress. Like for the price, this one originally was, oh, there's no price in it. Originally was like, I think for $79 or $99. And this it's good credit going for $30. And it's really, really good. It looks, it, it, it's a good, it has this, um, I don't know if you, the camera is going to catch it, but the, it has like gold details on it that uh, makes it look very festive. So you could pair this on, I'm pairing it with my yellow muse, as you can see on the side, but you can pair it on with gold sandals. And this is a good dinner or good outing uh, dress for this season. It's really, really great. I really love how it looks. I love how this slit detail on here comes up a little bit. So you can kind of show a little bit of legs. Really, really great. Um details it has a zipper at the back it has this button at the neck as well to kind of hold it on together it's a simple really really simple classy dress but it has a lot going on the kind of the kind of shapings you out and makes like i don't know it arranges your body for you it just arranges everything and makes it sit at the right places this is a really really good dress like the zara models don't do this dress justice this this dress it's for full-bodied girls like people that have like full-bodied women it's a dress for you because it just arranges everything puts everything in place and makes you look classy and sassy at the same time so this is not a regret buy. and the color isn't bad as well it's good on light skin and dark skin as well and depends on how you want to combine this in the summer you can wear this with yellow and in the winter you can throw this on with a lot of with a long boot or a short boot or anyhow you want to wear it but this is really really a good classy dress um yeah so I got another dress from Zara and oh, this dress had so much potential. Like, look at me in this dress. I feel like a Grecian goddess in this dress. So much potential. Ah, oh, this dress was such a letdown. So I tried it on and if you get your size in this dress, it is a gorgeous dress. It's this snake print dress in this color. Like, look at the way it fits me and it looks on my skin it's gorgeous however zara sent me a damaged dress so first thing um one of the buttons at the neck i'm going to show you this one it's bad so you see how this is looped yeah that one is damaged secondly another damage uh there so this one has to go back and if you manage to find this, I would recommend going up a size because there's a lot going on in this dress, especially here. And if you're top heavy, it's going to be a struggle getting the back to zip and uh, not revealing your boobs. So to allow some space for your girls up here, I'll recommend going up a size. But this is a gorgeous dress. Like, look at the bottom. It's so nice. It, it also has um, sparkly tread, like gold tread on it. This is such a gorgeous dress with so much potential. I don't know what happened here. Um, gold details at the hand, gold details at the back, gold details on the boobs, like gold details everywhere. And gold is so rich and expensive and elegant. And, oh my God, I don't know what went wrong. This dress makes me feel so sad. Like, I love how it looks on me. It makes me feel so good. But yeah, this one has to go back anyway. So yeah. Uh, next item I got is this chocolate, um, 
bodysuit and i wanted this because first of all i'm into chocolate these days i'm into brown tones which is so like me right because um my own <laughs> ridiculous love for color but these days i've been into chocolate and zara does have uh, chocolate is like the color of the season and so i wanted to grab some pieces of it for you if you know very if you've been watching my videos very well you would know that i have given my zara bodysuit the strap the sleeveless one a good wear the chocolate one so i decided to grab this one to kind of substitute or uh use as well and the, the fabric is not exactly the same as the other one it's a bit lighter i don't know why they did that it's a bit lighter than the other one but i like how this looks and you can see how i paired it i paired it with this um i paired it with this i'm going to talk about the pants in a minute this leather pants so again if you have been watching my videos you would notice that this is probably the third leather pants i'm getting uh, i have been on a hunt for a black leather pants and i haven't found any that fits me well so i grabbed this one this one was on sale this one was originally 59 it's now 20 dollars so i grabbed this one this is high waisted like it's really really high waisted you can see that on the video it's really really high waisted um it has snap closure and zipper the zipper is a bit wonky the zip is kind of bent um, you would notice it in the video it has a little bit of bulge but um so zipper detail high waisted um length is good i won't even complain about the length i'm not worried about the zipper i just don't I, the the crotch is a bit weird if you can see that the crotch is a bit weird and i don't know i paired it with this bodysuit and uh, my shoes and yeah i don't know how i feel about it it's just it's a bit weird it's a bit wonky i have to figure out decide if i like it or not i don't know if i like it truthfully but that's the black leather blazer uh, black leather pants next thing i got is this baggy waxed uh trouser baggy wax trouser green baggy wax trouser uh i got this in a size 10 because it's very stretchy and big and you see how i paired it i think i probably might have been able to go a size down but it really looks good um i don't know i'm on the fence about it i might i think it's too big for me but it's stretchy and nice um uh i got this in a size 10 this was also on sale original price was $49 it's now going for $19.99 or so so it's not bad I love how baggy it looks this comes in a green and comes in a green and a black I grabbed the green because I didn't have anything like this in my wardrobe um but yeah I can't even complain looks really good so that's that um finally I got this bag this one was also on sale I've been eyeing this original price for this was $59. Now it's like $20, $29. Been eyeing this for a very long time. Um, I like the only thing I like about it is the chain detail. And I this is this was this style of bag, this clutch style of bag was the style of the summer. I didn't want to spend full price on it, it's more like a bottega dupe, and came on sale and I grabbed it. I don't know. I styled it in several ways in this video and you could see it. It's a decent bag. I haven't used it. I haven't even removed the filler. I'm going to, it has a zipper closure inside and I don't know. I would style it more way and see if I'm going to keep it. But for 20 something dollars, I can't even complain. It's a decent bag. So yeah. And I think that's about it. That's the end of my haul. Yeah. That's the end of the video. That's the end of the styling uh, Zara haul. Let me know if you found anything you like. Let me know if you're interested in any pieces. Let me know if you if you like any of the styling ideas. Um, like I said, I bring out two videos every week, Tuesdays and Saturdays. So please check out my other videos. Um, yeah, check out the other videos. There's one here and down that you could easily check out right now. So check out these videos and let me know what you think. Thank you very much for watching till the end. Stay blessed, stay safe, and stay healthy. Bye.